Secretary Ben Hur Abalos Jr., the Depart of the Department of Interior and Local Government. Secretary Ivan Uy, uh, who has uh, led the charge with uh, our digitalization uh, as he heads the DICT. Uh, General uh, Be Benji Acorda, our Chief of the PNP. Uh, Chief Superintendent Manuel Golino, also the Director of Fire Services and in Enforcement Bureau. Fellow workers in government, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon. Today is a momentous occasion because we launched today two initiatives. The Electronic Local Government Unit, or ELGU, and the e-report systems that aim to digitalize government services for the benefit of every Filipino. These programs mark a paradigm shift in the way that our government and citizens interact with one another. With the power of technology, we can break barriers and bridge gaps in ways that we have never been able to do before. We recognize, of course, the uh, efforts of the, DIC, D, of the DICT and the Department of uh, Interior and Local Governments in their effort to leverage this technology to be able to deliver convenient and efficient services to the public. With the ELGU system, our people can avail of a wide range of local government services, including business permit and licensing, local tax processing, local civil registration, real property tax, barangay clearance, and information dissemination. In partnership with ARTA, or the Anti-Red Tape Authority, this will complement our efforts in eliminating unnecessary layers of bureaucracy, as well as making government transactions easier and more efficient. On the other hand, the e-report system will enhance the ability of the Philippine National Police and the Bureau of Fire Protection to better respond to the emergency needs of the public. I am optimistic that this system will be used to help curb criminality, lawlessness, and ensure immediate responses to various incidents around the country, thereby making our communities safer and more secure for everyone. We now live in a world where technology is occupying a vital and, and important part of our existence. Let us embrace it and see the good it can do for our society. What we see here is just a glimpse of what this digital revolution to, can bring to our society, to our systems, to our bureaucracy, to the way that we do business. There are even more profound changes that we can expect should we choose to apply technology in many aspects of our lives. I truly believe that digitalization will be a hallmark of our progress as we move to the future. Today, let us seize that opportunity to utilize this tool as a force for good, for our people, and for our nation. I thus urge all government agencies, LGUs, to collaborate with the DICT as we integrate all services into the recently launched eGov PH Super App to attain its objective of becoming a multi-sectoral mobile application for all government institutions and transactions. I also call once again on the DICT, DILG, and our LGUs to ensure the efficient implementation of EO number 32 to ramp up the implementation of infrastructure projects in the telecommunications industry so we can accelerate our country's digital transformation. Ladies and gentlemen, I am proud to be a part of this historic moment. As we have laid down the foundation for a new era of good governments, one that, is one that is defined by transparency, innovation, and efficiency. Let us continue to transform the way we serve Filipino, the Filipino people. Let us usher in a future fueled by digital empowerment and inclusive progress. Thank you very much to you all. Congratulations. Magandang hapon sa inyong lahat.